What's going on guys, it's Ramana, and today we're doing more critiques. Uh, wait. Okay, just had to pull up my list. Alright, so, let's get started. I did notice, I got over 100 subscribers, and I did, I did notice a while ago, but the reason I haven't done the 100 yet is because it's still insanely hot here, and I have to turn off all my fans in here. And like, I can't sit here for somewhere like upwards of 30 to 40 to maybe an hour and film something because I'll get drained and I'll, it's just going to be like torture in here. So I'm waiting for the weather to cool down a bit. Anyway, the first level we have is Nutshell 345 and his stage Amiibo Fun. Let's go ahead and edit. Uh, already right out of the start, I see a huge problem whatever let's play it yeah there we go that's really bad don't do that I keep telling you guys don't do that oh I need to unlock villager damn it I need want villager and Sonic I have their amiibos but I don't want to open them like I have amiibos of all the characters in smash I play with the exception of uh I need to get, uh, oh fuck, like, Ryu's not out yet, and I need to get Falco. I think I got everybody else. Yeah, I do. I know it's okay, I just hate those jumps I can barely make. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I need to get good. Ah, fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay. Hocus, hocus. Ah, oh, shit. Oh. WarioWare? Any of them? I love that game. I have almost all of them. I think I'm missing a couple. I forget which, though. I know I don't have the one on the Wii U. Yay, Pikmin! I also have all the Pikmin games. I fucking love the Pikmin games. I just remember I couldn't beat the first one until like I had to go back as an adult because as a kid it was way too fucking hard for me or confusing. Like, and one thing I hate in games, like I absolutely hate, is having a timer. I don't like being rushed in games at all. And since like it was difficult for me because like the whole game was timed and I didn't know how much like room for error I had as a kid so I had trouble like getting all the shit pieces and like or at least getting one in a day. Uh, I jumped a flagpole. Alright, let's see. Come on, there we go. Alright, first off, this is horrible. Stop doing this. Do not put me in danger right out of the start. Like, say if I was in- okay, like, here's an example. Say I got this in 100 Mario Maker, or I bought this thing, like, I didn't go to the editor first. I, there's almost no way I would react to that in time. Because I'm still, like, trying to go, okay, what do I have to do here? Instead of going, oh god, fucking move. Uh, the jumps are fine. What's the point of the thing down there? Uh, I guess that's fine. I wish your level had more of a... Like, I wish it was more... Uh, what's the word? It made more physical sense. I know it's Mario, but I think that's important to make your game make physical sense. Or sorry, make your level make... Oops. Oh, he falls off. What's the point of that, then? Ah, shit. Uh, that part's okay, I guess. Fuck. Uh, okay. What is that so What is that sound from? Like, Animal Crossing is one of my favorite games, and I don't know what that's from. I thought the death sound would be the sound when, like, you get stung by bees or something. Uh, okay. trying to think like it's like outside of this it's okay 
okay, but... Uh, I don't know what it's missing, like, I'm not having fun with this one. There's nothing down here? There's no point to being here? Wait, let me check. Yeah, there's no point- why even have that there, then? Oh, got the top tier bitch again. I'm about to fucking fare all the enemies. Watch. Okay, um, first off, I want your level to make- Here's what I mean by that, and I have no clue why this is here. Get rid of it. Okay. Um, these serve no purpose. They're not even, like, an echo because there was no paratrooper- paratroopas over here. Did I miss them? Wait, where did those go? Did those render? I don't remember those. Your dude, you have a lot of pointless enemies. Uh, just get rid of that. Yeah, the paratroopers don't render. That's not your fault. I just don't- Oh, come on. Mario Maker has a weird issue with rendering. Okay, um... Let me start with making your level make physical sense. This is what I mean. Can you do this? To make it look like it's actually resting on something? It's not just floating? I think making it visually make sense is important. I guess you can have that jump. Um, it does kind of punish the player if they miss it, but I mean, if you can't jump that, I don't think you should be playing Mario. Um, there's no point for that lower area, so I would just get rid of it. And here's something I like to do, I don't know if you guys do this, but I was talking about how I like my levels to make physical sense. Uh, where is what I'm looking for? Here it is. Where's the one I want? There we go. Uh, just doing this. Oops. Stop. There we go. Like, I don't know, I just liked doing that. Okay. Uh, this is fine, I guess. It's not too difficult. Uh, this part's okay, too, I guess. You just sort of inch along, but that's okay. This enemy is pointless, and, um... I would change it out for a red, or just get rid of it. Yeah, change this out for a red. So now we got all the fucking ugly reds. I'd be really surprised if someone got that reference. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, that part's okay, I guess, because you gotta catch the mushroom. Alright, I get that. Um, I guess this part's fine. I don't mind. The difficulty curve doesn't seem too ridiculous, so it's okay. Uh, then we come back to more pointless enemies. Yeah, just get rid of all of them. Put, like, paratroopers in the way or something. There we go. Like, just do something else, because they don't... Those Goombas just fall, so why even have them? Like, you even barely see them, so there's no point. Like, I don't know, do something like that or something. Obviously, place them a little more, you know, creative than I did, but you get the idea. See, now it actually makes sense, because if they fall in there, they're gonna stay on the platform. And I'll have to kick them off. Which makes more sense to me. Yeah, you might have to move them around a bit, because I think that might be too difficult. Now, this is fine, but they're not rendering, and I don't know why. Maybe, let's try this. Let's see if I do one, and it renders. Yeah, they're not rendering. Yeah. Uh, I hate doing this, but we're gonna have to do this. I really don't like doing this, but I had to do this in one of my levels where there was issues rendering. I hate this dude, like, I'm sorry that part doesn't work. Oops. 
But yeah, you get the idea. I hate that, man. Um, but then you could also do this. Make sure, like, I don't know, keep the Goombas in so they're actually obstacles. So they don't just walk off the edge. Um, I'm okay with this part. It's not too bad. This is fine, I guess. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, this, you need to put something here. And again, physically having it make sense would be nice. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, you get the idea. So just like copy that here, and then like... Oh, you have to make it a little longer. But anyway, you get the idea. Um, I would put something here. And then maybe like put another life in it or something. There we go, so it makes more sense. Uh, these paratroopers serve no purpose. Well, actually, now they do. They do now. It's sort of an echo, but you... I don't know, you have too much. And again here, the same thing. Make it physically make sense. Oops. Yeah, I'd move the flagpole back a little bit. But other than that, yeah, that's all you need. So, it's alright. Like, with those changes, I think it's- I think it's okay. Next we have... Stacks Deluxe. Sorry, I had trouble reading that. And your level is... Bomb and Bullet Bullies. By the way, um... Nay? Is that how you say your name? Your level didn't work. Uh, I think you took it down. Um, so if you can get that back to me within like a day or two, I'll be sure to like get yours as soon as you message me. If you changed anything. Ah, fuck. There we go. Can I even get up? Oh, there's a pipe or something. Alright. That's cool. Oh, fuck. Okay, wait. I got this. Okay, hang on. There we go. Can I... Can I just get over there? Thank you. Alright. I'm assuming that's just a little extra area. Oh, don't have it put me back at the beginning of the level. Because then it's like, why would I want to go there? Because it, it was like, it gave me a few coins and then it punished me. Uh, there's this thing in games uh, that might help you guys out called positive and negative reinforcement. And it's a little confusing, so like, hear me out. So right there, that was... Um, that was negative reinforcement. Because what it did was, I did something good, and then it punished me for it. Whereas positive reinforcement would be like, I did something good, so you rewarded me for it. And then here's the confusing part. If you, if I did something bad, and you rewarded me for it, that is also positive reinforcement. It's like adding on to it. So like, ah, oh, dude. Oh. I'm sorry, that's one of the things that irritates me the most in Mario Maker. I hate that. Cause that's essentially going the game like, haha, I just killed you because you you don't fucking, you gotta play the game again. And I'm assuming I have to get up there. Um, there we go. Uh, okay. Can I get... can I get in the door? I can't... I can't get in the door. Okay, well, that's broken and we need to fix it. I don't know if you could do it, but I can't do it. And guys, I want to emphasize the importance of testing every part of your level. Don't just like go, oh, well I 
could beat it uh, if I took the direct path, therefore, uh, what does it say? So it's like, oh, so the rest must be fine. No, check every path and test every single path. And Dude, come on. No. That's ridiculous. Don't do that. See, now I don't. I hate all the secrets in your level because you punish me for finding every single one. Every freaking time. What does that say? Jamac? Big Jack? That's Big Jack? The best civil rights activist of our time? Okay, bouncing off that. I get that. Okay, you want me to do it a lot? That's fine. Did I go to this secret? Yeah, this was the stupid one. You have a lot of multiple paths. Dude, come on! This is ridiculous. Don't do this. I'm doing good things and you keep punishing me for it. Like, why should I even bother looking for secrets? I should just run a straight shot at this point. If that was your point, I don't think you did it well. There was another room I couldn't fi quite figure out how to get into. Uh, more coin pictures. Pipes that drop you out, and then that with a door past the end? There's a secret here with the heart door. Oh, again, I go past the end, and you send me backwards. Stop doing that. Like, stop it. It's bad. Irritating, and it makes me not want to play your level, because I'm like, oh, if I explore anywhere outside the level, I'm just gonna get fucking punished for it. So why explore? Just run straight. And I'm just saying, like, if I was playing this on 100 level, I would just get irritated the second I saw that and skip it. I would just get really irritated. So yeah, you need to remove... I'm not gonna do it because it's gonna take too long, but you need to remove every shortcut that sends me backwards. And you need it to either put me back in the same spot or move me forward in some way. I know someone brought this up earlier with one of my secrets that they don't like secrets that send you straight to the flagpole and in my last level I had that you kind of I kind of had to send you there. There was no other way because if it sent you not quite to the right spot you can't get the flagpole at the top because you need something from earlier in the level to do it. God this see this one has so many things I don't know where to start. Like, I think the design feel the design feels messy. Hang on. I want the Tanuki tail real quick. I wish if you did that and people started Mario Maker, it just immediately like gave it to you. Like at the start of the level instead of uh Sorry, instead of um like, making you have to spawn one over his head. I don't know why, I don't like that. Oh god, you have one secret that sends me forward. Did I go in the secret backwards? Well, don't make it so I can go in the secret backwards. Put it up here or something. And then add coins. Stop punishing me for doing good things. All right, I go up here where Big Jack is. That was satisfying. I like. Oh no, not that! I couldn't see where it was. Yeah, I'm gonna ask you remove the bomb up there because. I guess you could kind of see the feet, but I couldn't s really see it at all. It was too small, and there's already the white speckles in the background, which makes it harder. I'm assuming I gotta do this. Okay. Oh, I could've probably gone up there, too. And then again, you punish me for it. Uh, I guess this is fine. Again, your level seems like really sloppily put together.
Yeah, this is okay right here. Oh, God, this hidden block. No, get rid of this. Move or move it somewhere else. Do not do this. That That is the most irritating thing. Was killing me with something I had no way I could see coming. I don't know, move it back there or something. So, like, if I'm run and jump, I don't, like, die. No, maybe I could still die. Hang on. So, I, like, ran and I jumped in. Okay, maybe that will work. There we go. I can still reach it. Yeah, please, please do that. Don't put it around an area. Again, fix your door up here. Oh, you have a hidden block here. Uh, oh, the Tanuki tail, I can break this stuff. I like that even though I got in the secret... Oh, no. Ah. Dude, did you test this? This level feels heavily untested. Like, heavily untested. Oh god, another secret that actually sent me forward. There we go. See, yeah, this reward is very unfulfilling. I have to go backwards in the level and all you give me is coins, like... Just get rid of that secret, it's not good. I think a lot of your level needs to be overhauled. It's hard, because there's so much that needs to be changed. Again, biggest things. Fix your secrets. Either have them drop me in the same spot, or send me forward a little bit. Um, you have too many secrets that it's kind of annoying. I think that's too many. Uh, bring it back down to like maybe two, maybe three. Um, your spike balls serve no purpose because they're nowhere else in the level. Um, this place, I don't know. Okay. The cannon bouncing is fine, but I think you need more of a break area in between. Yeah, this block needed to be moved. Your secrets, a lot of them need to be removed again. Uh, I don't know why the level gets easier over here. Why it suddenly gets easier. You should swap this out where this part should be in front and the part where you bounce off the cannonballs be later. Because your difficulty spikes are going up and down. Your curve is like all over the place. Uh, I think that's it. And this is the most irritating or no, maybe the one near the end that sent me to the beginning of the level, but I think that's it. I honestly think your level's not working, and I think you should just start over. Like, you're kind of all over the place, and I don't get what your concept is. Even at the title, I kind of don't get it. But yeah, this is one of the examples where the idea isn't working, so I think you should start over. You can try and rework it, but I think you should start over. What's it called? Bomb, bomb and bullet, bullies, secrets. Oh, it's built around secrets. Yeah, don't, don't do that, please. Don't build your level around secrets. Especially ones that punish you. That makes even less sense. Anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for giving me 100 subs. That's amazing. I love you all for it. Um, go ahead and actually vote in the comments what you'd like to see for the 100 subscriber special. And as soon as it cools down a bit, I'm going to do it. So whether you want me, some people wanted me to tell stories. Some people wanted me to do hour long critique videos and try and get six in one, you know, in an hour. Um, I can do a combination of both. I could do like half critiques and half funny game industry stories, whatever you guys want to hear. And I hope you all have a wonderful Thursday. Yeah, it's Thursday. And goodbye.